process of putting up this big tent. It should increase our production by at least 20%. The people right now that are waiting an hour, hour and a half in line, we should be able to get them down to maybe 30, 45 minutes. We're hoping that this tent will be able to accommodate at least 16 cars inside the tent. Uh, so it'll keep our staff out of the sun and uh, should be a great blessing. up this tent this week. We had two smaller tents. A good friend of ours lent us his big tent. It's 40 by 80 and it's allowing us to increase our production and I don't know whether the salvation count will be greater or not but we're definitely getting the people uh, through the line much quicker. Right now the line is uh, this time of day is at least an hour and a half for the people to be able to get through the line. But everybody waits patiently. Come on into the tent. Yeah. 
These people that are leaving have already been loaded with food. It's a lot of work, physical work, just to load their vehicles with what God has provided. And uh, uh, Michelle, how many people did we have come to know the Lord on that last? 18 people just come to know the Lord on this last go around. Many of the cars have two, three, four people in them, and everybody hears a message. They drive under this tent, roll the windows down, have a preacher that's up here on the stage. Already loading the tent again for the next message to be preached. It's, it's a huge production. And we do this on Wednesdays and Fridays. But the amount of food that leaves out of here every day is just absolutely phenomenal. This is Becky. Today, she's a preacher, but also today she's directing traffic. This is the first day that we've opened up our new tent here. So uh, people are a little hesitant to drive under the tent because it doesn't look like they got enough room, but they're already getting used to it. I come down here at 5.30 in the morning to start putting this stuff underneath the tents and getting ready for the day. And there's already a, a lineup of cars, and we don't open it till nine. So it's it's phenomenal how long people wait. You can see the cars as they're lined up all the way down through here. We kind of make a big loop, and then over here. The cars will stretch back right, right now this time of day. The cars will stretch back at least a half a mile, four or five blocks. It's just phenomenal what the Lord is doing. You could have not told me that uh, some of the best harvest that we've ever had in the way the cross would be coming right through our own parking lot, and it would be America. It's just phenomenal. God bless you, and thank you for listening.